as men who want to perceive ourselves as good, we have a responsibility to challenge our preconceived notions surrounding violence against women, to educate ourselves and take a proactive, strong, and visible stance. Most importantly, we need to have these conversations with other men. We need to not only speak out against abuse, but to demonstrate how our culture perpetuates and normalizes this violence through sexist jokes, locker room talk, slut shaming, and talking about and treating women in dehumanizing ways. We cannot always expect women to educate us about these matters. We are all very capable of doing this ourselves. There are countless books and resources that can give us critical insight into how we can be better allies, feminists, and in turn, men. If we wait for women to educate us about these subjects, we are asserting that these problems are not a high priority. And the message that we send with this passivity is that we are not allies. We must not leave women to fight these battles alone. And it is important to consider how people face additional challenges, being impacted by these and other forms of oppression when they are people of color, LGBTQ, poor, undocumented, disabled, etc.